What is up, my beautiful babies and gays of the world? It's your girl, Keelan, aka it's Keelan, and I am back with another mother freaking video. Now, before we yep before we start this video i want to say thank you for getting us to 800 we're over 800 now but i want to say thank you for getting us to 800 you know we are continuing to grow i asked y'all to give me to 800 in like a week and y'all did it in like a day and a half so shout out to y'all because y'all the bomb.com next is 850 then we're gonna go to 900 then we're on our way you know we're on our way to 1000 subscribies but as you can see from the title of the video, um, I'm going to show you guys how I do my edges for short hair because, um, you know, back last year I did the big chap and then I just kept cutting it. So now I'm on a hair growth journey to regrow my hair so I can get my curls popping again. You know, I did, um, I washed my hair today and, you know, my curls are, are they're, they're healthier is what I'm trying to say. So now I'm going to show you guys how I do my edges because a lot of people ask me, to do a edge tutorial video especially since i have shorter hair or if they just love how i do my edges i don't really think i do them that well to be honest but i don't want to disappoint so i'm gonna show you guys how i do my edges now um i'm gonna show you what i use and i use an edge toothbrush or a regular toothbrush that you no longer use um and i use either edge control or eco styling uh, professional styling gel now this one I use this one a lot a lot I love using this one um, as I was saying I use this one the most um, because it has um, black castor oil and it also um, black castor oil and flaxseed oil it also contains vitamin E fibers and omega threes so um, it promotes hair growth shines nourishes repairs and grows no flake which I love that and it's no tack and it's anti-itch. This is the one I love using. This is honestly the bigger um, container. It's normally a lot smaller than this, but I got this from Meyer for like three or four bucks. Um, so yeah, I love using this one out of all of the um, Eco Styling Eco Stylers. This one is my favorite. So now I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna show you guys how I like to do my edges. So I'm just gonna, first I like to start off by brushing my baby hairs down, just to catch all of them. So now that I have my baby hairs brushed to where you can actually see them, I like to just go in and I don't start right in the middle. I start off to the side and I just, before I put any um, styling gel on it, I like to just brush up a small section, push it, and then take the gel. Now, I don't know why, for some reason, I just find that once it, it, it just works better because it has like... I don't know I don't know how to explain it but this just works better than going straight in with a gel for me um, a lot of people obviously do it different this is just how I choose to do it and it works for me so now that I have that slicked as you can see my hair is really super curly so I like to it gets kind of like the the gel starts to stick to my hair so you just want to make sure that you're blending and you're pushing and like brushing the curl out that way it doesn't do that as much if that makes sense so now that i have that one i'm just going to go ahead and part the uh, the next section make a small part as you can see it's separating and then continue to do that So 
now that I have all three of these, I call them sections, but now that I have this side of my edges laid, I'm gonna move on to this side. I don't like to do the middle. I like to leave the middle for the um, the last part that I do. I like to do the sides first and then just blend the middle in. It'll, it'll, it just makes sense to me that way. People do it differently. It's just all how you prefer to do it. see um i'm constantly taking my brush first brushing over it and then smoothing it smoothing it out with my finger just so i can lay extra flat from what my brush misses i smooth it with my finger normally when I do my edges the way I just did it there's like a little section here that like still is left now it depends on how I'm feeling that day I'll just take it and swoop it up just like that it doesn't like there's just a little bitty section so I'll swoop it back just depends um so after that normally I'll spray it with my got to be glue spray um, but I don't have that with me because as I said in my last video, I what, or I'm at my best friend's house. But this is pretty much how I do my edges. And then after I, um, after I spray my Gossip Bee spray, I'll go ahead and I'll tie my edges down with a satin scarf or just a regular scarf. And give it like 10, 15, 20 minutes, however long, just depending on if I have somewhere to go. And then I'll take it off and that'll be that but yeah guys this is pretty much how i do my edges all the time um it it works out for me it works out you know there's not this is a simple tutorial um so i hope you guys learned something from me today i don't know um i hope you guys like this video don't forget to like comment share subscribe to the channel we would love to have you i would love to have you please 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 give me a big thumbs up it really helps me out um and always remember stay classy and a little bit trashy and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out